Hi, this is Dr. Darren Schmidt at the Nutritional Healing Center of Ann Arbor, and I'm going to talk about the biggest modern breakthrough in medicine, and it's this nutrient, MTHF. It stands for methylene tetrahydrofolate. So, uh, certainly the alternative doctors are um, using this. They're knowledgeable about it. It's not part of conventional medicine. You know, of course, it's always the alternative doctors that are leading the charge in research and new clinical uh, therapies to get people better. So if you have a conventional medical doctor, they may or may not know about this. You have to maybe go to somebody who is into alternative medicine. So, okay, here's a background on this. Um, we had the Human Genome Project, which was completed in 2006. So all of our DNA was mapped out. And they discovered some problems in our DNA um, that are called genetic SNPs. And a SNP is actually um, SNP, which stands for Single Nucleotide Polymorphism which just simply means that there's a mistake in our DNA line. So maybe, you know, when our bodies were first created a long time ago, maybe our DNA was totally, absolutely, 100% perfect. But the point is, over time, we've had uh, stressors or assaults, if you will, on our bodies like radiation from the sun or um, some toxicity exposure to uh, uh, natural gas in the ground or oil or mercury. I mean, these are all naturally occurring toxins that are in the environment. And so, when you're exposed to a toxin, it can change your DNA. When you're exposed to a bacteria or, or virus, it, it changes your DNA. Uh, parasites, actually, they, they mix in with your DNA. Uh, pathogens mix in with your DNA. So, yes, we have 1.5 million... 1.5 million genetic SNPs, and they're known. So how many can we fix? We know how to fix three of them that I'm aware of, and uh, we're still new in this subject, but this is one of them, and this is absolutely phenomenal. So what, what makes this important is um, this nutrient is part of a pathway, biochemical pathway, that makes other nutrients and um, things like neurotransmitters uh, you know, nutrients for the nervous system. And then it also makes a hormone called SAMe. You may have heard of that. It's for happiness. And then off of that, we get what's called um, <clears throat> methylation, which is includes detoxification, so cleaning of the body. And we also get the turning on and turning off of genes. So 90% um, of our DNA is not expressed physically by our body. So I have blue eyes. That's a genetic phenotype. So phenotype means a physical expression. And the genes are a genotype. So the genotype of my DNA shows a phenotype of blue eyes. So, but with MTHF, you can turn on and off all kinds of uh, genetic phenotypes. It'll, it'll, I mean, it'll change the genotype. It'll change a gene. And then symptoms go away. So I did a video on unpredictable food allergies that is fixable by adding in MTHF, and then your, de your genes work better, your digestive system works better, because you've just changed your DNA expression. I did another video on pinpoint migraine pains, and those are, what I'm finding is they're frequently caused by a little tiny fungal problem, like a fungal infection or bacteria or virus, sitting right where that pain is, and then you take MTHF, it strengthens your immune system, now you have a stronger immune system phenotype expression, and your immune system takes care of that. Um, another thing is, I mean, there's other examples. I'm going to stop right there. But I'll give you a resource right now. There's a website called mthfr.net. Now, the R stands for reductase. That's an enzyme that makes the MTHF. So the genetic problem that a third of Americans have related to this is that our, our DNA is not making the enzyme. It's not making the methylene tetrahydrofolate reductase enzyme. So therefore, we don't make the methylene tetrahydrofolate. So, and there's a DNA test. You can do this. Um, 23andme.com. And I, uh, I did DNA testing on myself. And I am positive for this, I, I am missing this genetic um, uh, biochemical pathway because my genes don't make the enzyme. 
So, and it may, and 42% of Americans from European descent have uh, this missing. 45% uh, of Japanese have this missing. So um, it's just totally genetic. So you go on the supplement, MTHF supplement, and you can find it online. You can buy it at a health food store if they know what they're doing. And um, you take it every day for the rest of your life. And that's the solution. So um, now this website has a whole list of symptoms that we, you can get when you have this genetic problem. One of the symptoms is heart disease. Another is cancer. Um, addictive behavior, ADHD, the, the, there's like 80 or so symptoms that are caused by this. And when I say symptoms, it includes diseases like heart disease. And so anyways, this is the beginning here. This is modern medicine right now. We know how to fix three out of 1.5 million genetic SNPs. And this is in my 19 years of practice, this is the biggest breakthrough that I've seen, and um, the, I've put probably 100 people on this nutrient in the last three months, or two and a half months. And um, I had a woman with a urinary tract infection, and I don't diagnose an infection, of course, I'm not a medical doctor, but she had burning and bleeding, and she had a fever and pain, and pain with urination, and... Um, I found that she needed this, and yeah, uh, she chose not to go get an antibiotic. She could have gone to urgent care, but she chose to see me. I put her on this. The problem went away overnight. It was gone uh, in 12 hours or maybe you know 15 hours. It was gone overnight. So I've never seen that before in my practice. That's never happened probably in the history of the world <laughs> when it comes to healthcare and uh, antibiotics and immune system nutritional support and all that stuff it was tremendous so but i'm getting results just tremendous awesome results of people getting stronger immune system getting stronger um, um sleeping better detoxing all that stuff so there's the history of uh, mthf it's new it's since 2006 and uh, but we'll we'll be looking for more uh, breakthroughs in repairing biochemical pathways that have been broken by altered G uh, DNA or altered, um, you know, like genetic SNPs. So this is where health, uh, medicine and healthcare are going.